Okay, let's do an update now. The lower control arm is in. In a separate video, I showed the front upper. Now, you can see that I've installed the new spring with the new rubber bushing up top. Now, you had to compress this back in, so look down here and you can see I've got a three-ton jack. And I've come in from the opposite side and compressed that spring upward enough to where I could now inset the knuckle and set the, the uh, castle nut. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and install the shock because that will give me some support too uh, for that spring. So coming up next will be the shock. So there's the knuckle. Now remember when you put the knuckle on, make sure that your tie rod in is on correctly. So, and to transfer your old hardware over. Uh, but otherwise you can see where my hub is gonna be sitting and um, the rest of the hardware. All right, now again, that's not torqued down the lower arm yet because I've had to adjust it to get that spring in. But that's coming up.